Pierre Roger Ducos, the 25th of July 1747 to the 16th of March 1816, better known as Roger Ducos, was a French political figure during the Revolution and First Empire, a member of the National Convention and of the Directory. Topic: In the Revolution. Born in Montfort and Chalice, Aquitaine now in Lands Department, he was elected deputy to the convention by the département of the Lands. He sat in the Plain the party which had no clear attitude, and served to sway the vote. He voted for the death of King Louis XVI, without appeal or delay, but was not prominent in the convention afterwards. Ducos was a member of the Council of 500, over which he presided on 18 Fructidor Coup 1797. At the end of his term, he became a justice of the peace, but after Barthélemy Catherine Joubert's coup d'état the 30 Prairial of the year 8, or 18 June 1799, he was named a member of the executive directory, thanks to the influence of Paul Barris, who counted on Ducos as his partisan. <laughs> Consulate, empire, and exile On 9 November 1799, Ducos accepted the coup d'état of Napoleon Bonaparte the 18 Brumaire, and was one of the three provisional consuls with Napoleon and Emmanuel Joseph Sillas, becoming vice president of the Senate with the arrival of a stable consulate formula. He was many times honored under the empire, but in 1814 he abandoned Napoleon, and voted for his deposition. He sought to gain the favor of the government of the Restoration, but in 1816 was exiled on the basis of the law regarding the regicides. He died in March 1816 near Ulm, from a carriage accident. 